Wednesday, January 4th and I am still very much jet lagged and still very much functioning on the US clock but I'm guessing after the weekend I'll be back to normal and also a lot of people ask me how it feels being back in South Africa for some odd reason I feel like I was just here yesterday like it's not unusual there's nothing shocking except for the prices like your everything is expensive you know where i come from the u.s where everything is expensive and i get to my country where i'm, th I'm thinking there's great affordability here which there is for some things but listen it's just as expensive like it's really expensive Good morning. Over here. i just woke up um i'm literally functioning on the u.s clock it's currently morning in the u.s and i was only able to sleep around um around 10 a.m. South African time and probably like in the a.m.s for I don't know probably midnight in the U.S. I'm not too sure, but I just woke up and um, it is currently um, oh my watch is dead, my phone is dead. I need to go buy I need to go buy a charger, well an adapter that fits in the in the South African um, port. So it is currently 5 p.m. <laughs> in South Africa. A little bit of focus there. And it's currently 5 for 5 um, and I'm getting ready to head over to the iStore to get an eSIM for my phone and um, a, 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 um, an adapter to charge my phone too so that I'm able to function normally. So that's why I'm actually not able to do much of vlogging because I don't want to kill my battery because I need it. Um, and the only way I can actually come back from the mall or Uber back is, is with um, an eSIM because um, I cannot hotspot my phone with my American number. So that's the situation today. I'm gonna get ready and I'll be off to the mall. Hey guys welcome back to day three so this is a day in cape town by myself i came here because i needed to do a few things and my mom was working the weekend so i figured i'd take this time to actually catch up on a few things i needed to catch up on and also i just needed some time off as i was going through so much in such a short space of time so yeah but overall is the uber business a good business uh, when is summertime like this uh Oh. Uh, it's better and it's too easy. I see. Because more people are on the go and stuff, and there's tourists. Yes, uh, yes, there is tourists, but not like the, uh, when it's dry season. Yeah. Oh, okay. And it's like also the price. It's better to the driver. Oh. Yeah, it's affordable. It's affordable. For petrol and. Yeah, and yeah I see. Mm. Well, But sometimes when it's quite like winter time. Yes. Uh, it's very tough. <laughs> You're just driving to buy buy a uh, petrol. Uh, yeah. Mm, yeah. Mm, mm. And sometimes and, you just and, get and, a few and, change. And you know that time, yeah. also the, the, the petrol goes up the price. Yes, you know it that? really does, yeah. yeah. We're always going up the petrol price. Uh. Going up, going up the petrol price. Use the right three lanes to turn right onto Helen Sutherland Boulevard, M6. 
Anyway, as I was saying, I just needed some time off to simply take it all in, the fact that I was back. And I also had to go do money exchange at the mall. So I took that time too to visit Ocean Basket as it has been on top of my list of places that I've really, really missed. Um, in this vlog, I'm simply admiring all that's around me. So you won't be seeing st uh, so much of my face, but I'm simply showing you guys what I'm seeing and I'm also letting you guys in on some of the conversation I had with the uber drivers that I encountered so yeah I hope you enjoy this vlog I also really admire the art that was in the mall as you'll be seeing in the next few slides um, I also want to include that I actually booked an Airbnb for my stay during this time in Cape Town I could only check in at 3 p.m. so that's why you only see the Airbnb at the end because I was there early in the morning and I spent all the time in the mall and then only after I was, I was supposed to check in that I headed to the Airbnb which you'll see in the end. I'll keep the menu 
Cheers! Yum! I got... I don't see the extra muscles. Oh, there we go. I asked them for extra muscles and change of the... This is so good. The bread was pretty good too. And my shrink is hitting. It has a little bit of bread, which I need. Yeah, so this is everything I want for today. Chill vibes, awesome basket, water brunch. You feel like... Feel like rain in the morning Giving me mixed emotions And it's too much sometimes Mix the potion Mix it up, girl, put it in motion Are you finding a time? It's no compromising Make up your mind We're running out of time It's so hard to try But it feels one side Drink. Me, I don't drink. Oh, 
spicy. Me, yeah, I don't drink. I never drink since I was born until now. Oh wow! I never smoke. Yeah. So if you meet someone who drink, it's a problem. So, uh, yeah. No, I can't. Like I say, it's good for me to stay like this. Oh, like but you can meet someone who doesn't drink, who goes to church. You can meet a good lady. I don't know how we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna see this one is the. You have to spend time with them and get to know them. And then you see, okay, maybe this is the type of person I like or not. Look for me. <laughs> I must look for you. Yeah, look for okay. me. Okay. It is not easy. Uh -uh. Yeah, it's yeah, not easy. I don't easy. Let someone break my heart. Uh, yes, definitely I not. Soft heart. So if you break it again, I'm dying. <laughs> I'm so sorry. It's not good. It's not good at all. Yeah. It's difficult because I'm at work after here I'm going to church. Oh well you don't meet anyone at church? No at my church they are old, they're small, the young. Ah oh, there's no good age for you. Uh, yes. Oh I see. Yes. You can see someone ah, she's beautiful but she's older than you. Oh. So Church, church, ah, mm. they start uh, adding themselves uh, uh, behind the Bible, but they are not good. Also. Oh, they just hide behind the Bible. Yes, yes. most of them they are not good. Mm. First, let me work, and then I can meet the people. And talk with. Yes, but yeah, at least this got, this this job is good because yeah. you can meet people. Yes, yes. yes. Thank you so much for taking time to watch this video. I'll see you on the next one.